Okay, so today's video, I hope I'm in focus. Today's video is three simple ways to make your penny board better, to ride better, whatever. Um, if you guys like the video, be sure to go subscribe. So with that, I'm gonna do a real quick test just to find out what I wanna change about it and want to improve, and then improve those things, and you'll, we'll get back to you. So let's go ride, and we'll come back. Yeah, so uh, the major three things that I saw, bearings can be improved, the wheels can be improved, and the deck doesn't have a lot, like a grip tape on it. So we're gonna add those three things. Now I do have a roll of grip tape back here. And I do also have razor blades, which you need, as well as a screwdriver somewhere. There we go. I came prepared because I knew I needed grip tape for it. Anyways, those three things together. We're gonna grip the top of the deck, and then that should be improved. And when it comes down to the wheels, because they're old, these are not that thick anymore, they're not that soft. I'm gonna put uh, butter balls on them from my longboard, the one we fixed in that video in the past. And those also have new bearings, which are Bones Reds ABEX 7s. These are ABEX 7s, and they roll pretty good still, but they're old, and they could be improved. New wheels, new bearings, new grip. That's the three things. Let's get to it. All right, so, the penny. Got the roll of grip. I didn't buy the most expensive grip tube in the world just because it's my penny board and I don't ride it all the time. And also when you're doing this, make sure to, to try not to get dirt and sand and everything else on it. Just take off one corner at a time. Not amazing. All right, so uh, the grip is done. It's weird looking, I'll give you that. Um, but I guarantee that it'll be obviously, well, it sounds stupid, but grip here. I'll have a better grip on it. So yeah, now that we did that, we're gonna go ahead, add the wheels, add the new bearings and go ride it and compare. I mean, I'll compare based off my opinion, but it's not much I can do to show you in video. Still, it doesn't look bad. I'm not the best of it, but it's not that hard. Just watch a YouTube video on it and we'll figure it out. Board. Whoops. Oh. 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 Those wheels and those bearings are going on the that board, and those wheels and those bearings, I guess we'll go on this one temporarily. All right. New penny and then old board. Uh, let's get a skate tool. Shouldn't be too hard. Would I recommend doing this on the beach where there's sand and my camera on an angle that's $5,000? No, but I'm gonna do it. One wheel, second wheel, switch. Oh, and I literally lost a bearing. All good. That's smooth, man. All right, and we're gonna do the rest of the other ones and then we'll come back. A few moments later. Well, it's rolling away from I just set it down. There's not even an incline here. All right, so what do we have here? We have butter balls, which are really old wheels, actually. These are not new ones, but if they were new, they'd be a little better. Uh, brand new Bones Reds bearings, golds, or some, something like that. I don't really quite remember, but they're big balls. That's what they are. And then I switched them out with these. Uh, then we also gripped the top. So we now have a new looking penny board. The wheels are definitely bigger than the ones on that, but they're not like too much bigger to where like it's obnoxious and like I can't turn, I don't think. Uh, with that, I'm gonna put this board away. We're gonna go ride this again and then we'll come back and I'll, I'll discuss things later at the house or somewhere where it's not as hot because I'm baking right now and it's super, super hot. Okay, so uh, yeah, let's go, ride. All right, we definitely got a smoother ride off the bat. We're rolling a little bit less just because the wheels are bigger so they have to turn harder to uh, keep the same momentum. But overall, I like this setup better. Okay, these spin really good. And I'm pretty happy with that. So, we're gonna go home now, or I'm actually gonna go to the beach, but we're gonna go home now and then we'll review them and I'll explain why each one's better and why you should do this too. Two hours later. Well, first off, this is much, much later in the day. Also, I'm in my girlfriend's bedroom. This is not my bedroom. But it is really nice looking, the camera, to be quite honest, in my opinion. So this is the penny board. This is the uh, mod we did. Obviously, you saw it. But my thoughts on it. First off, I think the butterball wheels 
super, super good at absorbing shock. Like it was a much smoother ride than with the stock wheels. But of course my stock wheels are a bit older, but then again, so are these. So, I mean, back and forth, whatever way you want to look at it, I think that it's still made a good improvement. And I think you should do it too. This is not exactly a cheap modification. These are $40 wheels by themselves. Um, and then the bearings themselves as well, which we'll get to in just a second, are $27. So right now off the bat, we're looking at $67 worth of upgrades minus the grip tape, which I did a terrible job on putting on to be quite honest, but that was a nine dollar grip tape it's not expensive grip tape but i also think that helped um so yeah we got butterball wheels i think the overall smoothness improved uh the bones red big ball bearings which are the ones we have in here currently which are actually only like two months old or this video right here is when i put them in so whenever that was posted that's when i bought them so to be quite honest i think that i think that they improved the board not significantly but i think the combination between the butterballs and the bearings like made the board a lot smoother of a ride and that's what i was going for that's the mods i wanted on this board and that's what i think everyone should add to it but if you don't want to that's cool you can do what you want to do and then the last mod we added which was the grip tape was just a minor thing because i feel like whenever the board gets wet especially when like it's even a little damp outside or it rained a lot as soon as your shoes touch the board it's like slippery as crap you can't stay on it i don't find confidence in myself to ride a board like this when it's wet outside so i went ahead and i just put like some cheap decent quality um grip tape i got off amazon for like eight bucks um i'll list everything that i put on here along with the actual board which not this actual deck because you can't find it anymore but along with the penny board um just down in the description. So if you want to go ahead and buy each one of these add-ons, you can go down there and just press the links. But yeah, overall, the grip tape, the new wheels, the different bearings, all three of those things I think heavily improve the board. Now, are they worth the money in comparison to the original? I don't I don't know. If you have the money to throw it on or you have the stuff laying around for, I don't know, just in case you happen to have it laying around and you don't really know what to do with it, I put it on the board for sure. Um, so I think overall the biggest improvement was the wheels, then the grip tape, then the bearings. So um, so yeah, that's that's my review. I guess it's more like advice, if you would, uh, on how to make this thing better because I think this thing's pretty decent, but it does have its flaws and that comes a lot to do with how smooth of a ride it really is. And now obviously the plastic deck helps that, but I think we made it a whole lot better this way. So if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to go down there, subscribe to my channel, like the video, and share it with someone who thinks this stuff's cool or someone you think that might be interested in it. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for coming to the channel. I hope to see you guys next time. And I'll, uh, I'll be posting next week. I post every single week, just stuff like this. So that's my girlfriend. <laughs> just letting you know. All right. See you guys.